Higher order cognition is a set of mental abilities that overlap in some respects, which is why they can be represented as a set of interlinked cogs. One of these cogs is conceptualization, which is about categorizing objects and ideas. Categorizing requires understanding the critical features that set boundaries for a category. For example, the concept of triangle is defined by critical features such as having three straight sides. Knowing such critical features allows students to quickly determine whether a particular shape is a triangle or not, and perhaps belongs to another category or concept. A prevalent concept students learn about early on is mammal. Critical features of mammals include warm-bloodedness and milk-producing glands. Knowing these critical features enables grouping animals into the mammal category or concept and distinguishing them from non-mammals. Another science concept is plant. Critical features of plants include the capacity to generate food via photosynthesis. Knowing these critical features enables grouping organisms into the plant category or concept and distinguishing them from non-plants. Here's an example from social studies or history, democracy, which is defined by critical features such as representative government and independent judiciary. Knowing these critical features enables grouping nations into the democracy category or concept and distinguishing them from non-democracies. Flexible thinking about concepts enables considering entities like unions or student councils as democracies or non-examples like the military. And here's an example from the liberal arts, Impressionism, which is defined by critical features such as ordinary subject matter and depiction of light. Knowing these critical features enables grouping artists into the Impressionist category or concept and distinguishing them from non-Impressionists. Flexible thinking about this concept enables considering whether poets or film directors can be Impressionists. One reason concepts are so important is that they spare long-term memory. By understanding the critical features, students can readily identify members of concepts like a shape as a triangle, an animal as a mammal, an organism as a plant, a nation as a democracy, or an artist as an impressionist. If you get the concept, you don't have to memorize every possible member of that category, like all the mammals in the world. And concepts are prevalent in just about every academic subject. For more practical psychology to enhance your life, check out psychbytes.com.